Hello, my name is Omni Quaggan and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you where to get the Arctodus, one of the um, ranger pets for Guild Wars 2. So, let's just get straight to it. So, we want to start in Wayfarer's Foothills at First and Fall Creek near the Vindrake's Homestead Wayfarer. We're going to run east and pass this very conveniently placed commander who probably isn't going to be there if you do this run, just being honest. There's a cave just behind him, just by here. So we run on in, and there's usually a veteran to fight. There's the veteran. And we've got one, two, three, as usual. Let's just get him. Why not? We don't need to, we did an aggro. But, yeah. Cool. Now that he's dead, we stay in uh, Wayfarer's Foothills, and we go over to Moberia? Yeah, Moberia. I never know how to pronounce these places. So, head west, run towards this cave, dodge these cannons, put the pet away just to make sure it doesn't aggro. Do, 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 do. Nothing following me. Come on. Dodge very late. <laughs> so, if you look at these cages, he's stuck behind that one, behind another ledge. So, let's break through, kill these. Blah, blah, blah. And they're just inside. If I can get a good camera angle. There's one, and a second, as you, you can see, you gotta target anyway. There's two. Okay. So, but what if you don't want to use Wayfarer's foils? So, let's go back to Lornar's Pass, because that was always a good place. So, we want to go over here to Nentor Valley. Past the lovely loading screen. Come on. Come on. Right, and we're going to run north, hugging this left hand wall. So there's a little bit of a trek, but there's like, until you actually reach where they are, there's no bad guys. So it's fine. So we're going to run past this door, yak. Past another one, through some trees, I'm giving you a running commentary of exactly what you can see on the screen now. I don't know why I bother, but we're just going to keep going, and going, and we're next to like a, the Raven Waypoint, the uh, point of interest, Waven Waypoint. So there's one over there, and I called target on one, two, three, and now I'm in combat. Oh, great. This one's going really well. I'm sure that's all the, the worst part of it though, famous last words. Um, yeah, now that he's gone, we're gonna go back to the Thunderhorns, which was one of the pr which is the waypoint where we got the um, Alpine Wolf. But instead of going south along the road, we're gonna go west. Right this way. So we go down this hill, blah blah blah. Towards this place I don't even want to try and pronounce the name. Pay too much attention to the name to fall down. Oh, I shouldn't have said that it would there wouldn't be any like anything else go wrong. Alright, try again. Go down this hill. Part of me wants to re record this, but meh. No one's perfect. I never said this would be a perfect run. Past unpronounceable lodge. Over here. Past some passed out drugs. And there's one over there, and if you look in here, there's another two, and a third. But, you may not like the last pass. You may want a challenge. So, let's go to a high level area. Let's go to the last place, which is in Frostgord Sound. And you're going to want to want to go to the Blue Ice Shining Waypoint. So, this is like the furthest pet away from the waypoint it could possibly be. Check this out. There it is. <laughs> so, yeah. This one's the simplest to get if you've already got the waypoint, but honestly, Wayfarer's Foothills is just easier because it's a low level place. So, yeah, that'll do for now. Um, next video, I'm going to look at one of the underwater pets, the Armor Fish. See you later.